to see more of those reset combos because they were just absolutely phenomenal. And so I'm hoping to get that same exact stage so we can see it. Because, I mean, 75% without a break blow is nuts. Exactly. Nuts. And again, you know, you want to try to match the speed if you can. If you can match that 11 frame mid and 9 frame jab, you'll never have to worry about losing the punch. You'll no always doubt. work. You'll no always doubt. have the ability to beat your opponent to the punch no matter what. So yeah. they both played the fast characters. And again, you know, he did suffer a loss to Nico. Mm. Uh, Quiggle did, but I don't know. I don't know how it's going to go. And again, you know, Nico and Christy are very similar. They're very similar, especially with the speeds. So yeah, um, we're going to see it. what happens. Wow, just like that, like there's it. a wall Good spam damage. there by Quiggle. Just the combo. She does a surprising amount of good damage as well. I mean, I really like Christy. Oh, yeah. Christy is really sick. She's been a sick character. She was just annoying to deal with because she was all over the place. Mm -hmm. But we don't see her as much anymore. So it is kind of refreshing to see Christy on the screen here. Yeah. A nice side step there. Nice recognition of the linear string. Right. Gets a ton of damage from it. Okay, there it is. He gets the grab. About 10% there. And he gets... So, all right, again, I want to point this out. The Japanese players, their whiff punishment on like moves that are literally coming right at you from two feet away is phenomenal. He's yep. just whiff punished that, you know, forward advancing string like it was nothing. He was right in front of his face. Yeah. But even though he's doing all that whiff punishment, Quiggles is right back in there. He's un he's unfazed by it. And the one thing Quiggles needs to do now is get away from this wall. It's a bad situation to be in. He's gotta watch how he's teching, because he teched himself right back into it. Minus three. Okay. Yeah. Okay, there's the down is okay. So nice thing, here it is. What's the mix up? Gets nice the grab throw. mix up. I respect it. The thing about that down eight plus K from Christy is, mm -hmm. you know, you know it's coming once they do it. But the problem is you have to respect it because she can delay it. And then if you want to try to react to it too late, you're gonna get hit. It's it's a really crazy screen to do it. And Quiggles is looking really crafty with these double side steps. Yeah, I mean, it looks sharp. I mean, it's good because now the players need the meter to sidestep attack. They're, you know, reserving themselves to do regular sidestep without the attack because you can still sidestep the attack. You just can't hit them. Yeah. Doing a double sidestep will act as kind of an attack because you're avoiding multiple moves at once, and you'll actually get that extra advantage in there from sidestep twice. All yeah. right, so there's the jab to finish out the round there by Logica. And that's what makes CO's Nico so dangerous. He'll throw out like a jab or mid-punch in that case and then follow it up very quickly with another high. Uh, so there's that 4-4 four, four punch again. You know, is getting a lot of miles off that 4-4 four, four punch. I mean, yeah. it's safe. you got to respect it. And he's always either going to sidestep, do the 1P, or hold mm. afterwards. And this is not going to feel good at all. I like the fact that Quiggle saved his meter right there. He knows that he's down around. He needs to save his meter for the final round. No doubt. No doubt about it. And Quiggles, he's going to have to make that adjustment where he recognizes CO and doesn't want to hold. Right. And he needs to do those quick launches. All right, so that was a crazy whiff. I'm surprised it wasn't nice whiff. Hold. Nice hold, and that's not Does enough. There's one more hit left, so and there it is. Yeah. So nice. I've noticed whenever Quiggle gets you down to a very low life, he does the no mix-up mix-up. You're going to lose to a low most of the time when you're about to die against Quiggle. Because yep. that's you just overthinking as yeah. a defensive player at that point. Is he going to use the meter? No, he's saving it. I respect that option. He's down to 50% life. One more launcher, and that could Ooh, and nice, the sidestep. Nice All right, and that's it. it. He's yep. going to use the meter. Oh, he's, he, he wants to knock him to. out of the window. He didn't even have to. Wow. Have to. And as you can see, guys, you That's don't need the meter. I mean, you can win without it. Look at the way he just did that. He didn't use the break blow for two whole rounds. He didn't even touch his meter. <sighs> this dude, I swear, this this face right here is just like, man, I don't want to show off this Christy right now. Right, look at him. He's like, rubbing his just, chin. It's he crazy two, to me, man. Quibble has two hairs on his chin, and he's, he's rubbing been, them right he's now. He's been sitting on this Christy back pocket Christy the entire time. We all thought that he was like, you know what? It's not as good, but nope. We're seeing it right here. Quiggles hey, I mean, look, Quiggles. we got to go with what we know. We know Quiggle has not been playing that much. We oh, know. he's been playing something, clearly, because this is nuts. Like, he's, he's going going to town on Seal right now. All right. Here we go. There's the nice. punch kick kick. And look, you see the way he's doing that. He's going into the serpent stance, and he's doing the double sidestep to make him bait out the hold. Yeah, and he's it's baiting perfect. out the break hold. It's perfect for players like Seal because Seal then has to make a choice. It's almost the equivalent of a quick launch because Seal's now like, okay, you're going to do something from the sidestep. I just don't know what. And Quiggle looking like he studied this matchup. He's going to get the oil truck. Is this yeah. going to be enough? And he see, he doesn't have the and beautiful oh, hold. Man. See, that that combo drop just costed him that. He could lose this round. No, he doesn't. Oh, he okay. Doesn't. 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 But either I mean, way, why risk it? Yeah, why risk it? Know your combo. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, could have been nerves. Could have been timing. <laughs> anything of any, any yep. number of things right there. All right, so beautiful. Gets to low hold. I've been noticing a lot of low holds in this game because there is no stagger escape. Nice. Your only two defensive options is to low hold or just hold in general or to use break hold. You yeah, got to hold now. And CO's got to be a little less predictable. That's the second high hold that we've seen from yeah. Quiggles that's been successful. He's got to do something different here. 
And I like what Quiggles is doing. He's holding on to his mirror. He's pretty confident that he's actually going to take this round. I just right. don't know. If and there's that to... guaranteed attack. Every time you get stunned, mm -hmm. especially mainly by a low stun, you on will get put into a slip stun and you get a guaranteed attack after. Yep. But I did find that you can break hold out of it, though. Yeah, for sure. You can definitely break hold. Seal's got to do something. His back is against the wall in the sense of this Wow. Game. And you know, that punch punch back punch by Christy is so good because nice he hold. has that back turn zero on block launcher now. And I like the adjustment we're seeing from CEO. He's getting his damage and then back dashing away, yeah. waiting to do the whiff punishment. It's just a matter of time before Quiggles, Quiggles figures that out. And I like this dynamic between both players that we've seen so far. All right, he's trying to get that oil truck. He really wants that black pickup truck in the background, but I don't think he's going to get it. And here goes Hilotica trying to carry him to the car, and he got it. Big There's that damage. amazing wall carry by... And he's get, oh, he didn't get the other car. Okay, he had to use the brake blow to get the car right there. Yeah, nice brake hold. He saved his meter. I think he's using this, looking to save his meter for a brake hold situation. Yeah. Which is smart. Because, again, as long as you have brake hold, the only mix-up, and this, this could be it. Smart. If he gets the brake blow, that could be it. And he doesn't use it. Okay. I think he knew it wasn't going to kill. Yeah. He himself But, again, that might either. cost him. That might cost him. He has one more chance here. And Ooh, and there's the nice break blow. He reacted break, to the string, <laughs> and he takes the game against Seologica. Yo, so smart. So smart. Look it at was him. Such, such a quick transaction of events yeah. there. In the end, look, Quiggles knew. Look, look at this dude's face. <laughs> Listen Quiggles to me. Knew. Look at Listen him. to me. He is feeling himself right now, and he reacted to that string. And Seal is like, this dude right here. Look at his lip. Look, this dude right here, I got something for that. Don't worry. Yo. I hope. Yo, he cell phone coaching? Do we have cell phone coaching? Yeah. No, dude, I think that's what's happening. I think we called him. We got him. All right, we're going to we're gonna address that later. Nah, All we, right, can, we, we can't prove that. It could be just notes <laughs> on his phone. We can't do that. We don't All need, right, we, we don't, don't know what he could phones. be watching Netflix. I don't know. <laughs> All right, here we Hope go. Not. There's the size to punch to start the round off. Nice, nice, nice from Quiggles. And again, he's starting off this round strong, just like he's done the previous two games. He's got Seal down to about half life. And we're seeing it right now. Seal... He just seems to be a little bit weaker against Nico. I mean, a little bit Ooh. weaker against Christy than, uh, than we all uh, expected. Uh, uh, uh. Give me that close hit. Yeah. Beautiful, 20%. Nice. And there it is. Quiggle. That's something you don't see very often against Nico is somebody walking up to him and grabbing him on wake up because you're usually so afraid of uh, CO pressing a button there. And it's just so crazy because we've seen CO compete and. It's like we're seeing a different CEO right now, or Quiggle is just that good right now. Yeah. Quiggle's like, he was looking good. so solid, and Quiggle is just honestly destroying this man right now. But as we say that, CEO is fighting back in this game three. He's trying to get something going. He's got to. This is loser's bracket. You nice cannot reaction. lose. There's the close hit. There it is. Uh, give me that. Not 20%. Dead. There it is. The back kick. That's all he needed is the stun. Flipped him on the other side. Oh, my God. Ooh. What's the mix-up? There's the break hold. And there's the sweep to end it. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's that was a such a good break hold. That was a great time to use the break hold right there. And I agree, I agree. And you know, he caught he caught Quiggles in a situation. Nice wow. hold. He tried to charge and that's what that I'm up. talking about. At this level, you've just got to hold things you exactly. see coming from a mile away. If you don't, you're gonna die. And there's that sidestep. That's, that's a game. dead. Nico is gone. Alright, so one more round, guys. Whoever wins this game is moving on. Whoever loses going home. Yeah, so yeah, so so obviously Quiggles is up two games to zero. If he wins this round, oh Zio's man, there's the launcher. Is he gonna save the meter? I respect it. And there's that combo again. Again, Nico's wall carry is the best in the game. Next to uh Coolish. He has great wall carry as well. Yeah, for sure. Alright, there it is again, that grab. One more mix-up to rattled. do it. Seal's rattled right now. He's pressing. And he's zero on blocks. And he Oh man, this could be bad. Seal has to defend. That's it. Yeah. That down punch to close it out. Yeah. Seal was rattled at that point. Great set, though. Great set. And just like that, Seelazic is going to be eliminated yeah. from the tournament before finals. So that means Seelazic and both Terror Rock are going home empty handed. Yeah. But they both made top eight. They oh, definitely yes. made some noise here in the United States. So shout out to both of those players traveling all the way from Japan to right. compete against America's best. So do you think that if 